All right, team, if you watched the other videos, you should know the answer to this. And the question is, are you living at your means, above your means, or below your means? All of these situations are things that you need to understand about your finances. So let's talk about the first one. If you're living above your means, what that means is you are spending more money than you have coming in. So if you're living above your means, you're not saving anything and you're actually spending money that you don't have. How do you do that? That's easy. That's how you get into credit card debt. That's how you get into situations where you have loans, uh, personal loans, things that you've taken out that you're not even able to pay for. So that's what living above your means is, and that's the worst situation to be in. The next one is living at your means. Now living at your means means that you're living paycheck to paycheck. You have just enough coming in so that you can pay what you need to going out. And that's better than living above your means, but you're not saving any money. There's no way that you are ever get out of debt if you are in debt when you're in that particular situation. And also if an emergency happens and you don't have an emergency fund and you're living paycheck to paycheck, you're really going to go further in debt. And then the last thing is the one that you want to be. You want to be living below your means. Living below your means is that you have more money coming in than you have money going out. And that is a positive situation to be in. And when you live below your means, I'm not saying that you can't go out every once in a while. I'm just saying that you don't want to waste money eating out every night, spending money that you don't have to spend when you could uh, be cooking at home. And I'm also sa not saying that you can't have fun with it. Some people think that if you live um, below your means that you're eating rice and beans. That's not what I'm saying. I'm saying you can have fun. Just make sure the money that you have coming in is working for you. You always want to be in a position where the money that you have is making money for you. Your money is working for you versus you always working for the money. So which situation are you in? Are you living above your means, at your means, or below your means? Put it down in the comment below.